This instructional video is designed to show you how to read a term symbol and introduce the idea of what it is. We actually develop some in a second video that's a bit more practical than this one. So a term symbol consists of three parts, two of which are numbers and one of which is a letter, but they all start off in the same way. So the 2s plus 1 is the multiplicity. And this is determined based on the arrangement of the electrons as spin-ups and spin-downs and whether or not they're paired. The part with the L is actually read as a letter and it's similar to what we do with the quantum numbers where 0 is s just like the s orbital, 1 is p just like the p orbital, and the L value of 2 is d, 3 is f, and it continues on just like with the quantum numbers. Now the value j is determined based on a series of rules governing the total angular momentum that comes from the spin multiplicity and the orbital. And so in this case, we have three different setups. We can do the absolute value of L minus S if the orbitals are less than half full. We can take the sum of L and S if it's more than half. And J actually equals F, S if it's exactly half. And we'll get into a case where we can see all of these in play and why this ends up being true. So in order to find a value for S for the multiplicity, we'll simply add up all of the spin quantum numbers. Uh, paired electrons will actually end up canceling. We'll discuss that a bit as well. So you can actually just skip to counting up your unpaired electrons. For the L value, uh, you'll just add the magnetic quantum numbers. And uh, to read off an actual term for your multiplicity, once you have a value for 2s plus 1, if it's equal to 1, that's a singlet, 2 is a doublet, 3 is a triplet, 4 is a quadruplet, etc. For the L part, you'll actually just say what the letter is. And for the J part, you'll simply say what the number is. So this is intended to give you an introduction to the idea behind the term symbol. Uh, what we'll do in a later video is actually show what that looks like for actual electron configurations.